guess you can't keep it. Sorry. No, that's all right. It's grade five hardware, anyways. What's what's going on in there? Grade, grade school shit. No, grade eight hardware is what you want. A grade five. That's what the Whoa. one episode of NCIS. The truck, the truck failed on that episode of NCIS because they had grade five bolts in it. <laughs> really? And the guy got sentenced for it because he the mechanic. Get the out of here! What do you need? The Can stick? Get the fuck out of the way! <laughs> I need you to take the movie down there. Here, just point it at the thing. Where's my socket, cocket? <laughs> Where is it, man? I need a half inch. Can you give me the fucking half inch, please? Yeah. I know you're not supposed to help, but fuck it. You're okay. Give me the half inch. Which one is that? Half inch, bike! <laughs> it's a socket, for fuck's sake! <laughs> is it this one? 16. Well, then it's not. Half inch is a half Fifteen. Inch. Half inch is a half inch. It's I don't know how big that is. This is three quarters. Why are you picking up the biggest ones? It's a half inch. It's That's a, a quarter. Fourteen. I don't want that. Okay, hold on. I'm almost there. Right here. <laughs> Fuck off. <laughs> so if I'm fucking out here at uh, Katie's place right now, and her fucking truck's been all fucking dicked. It won't start, uh -huh. and I got a uh, bank under the fucking truck taking a look at shit, trying to figure it out. Let's go bug him a little bit. Has that ever happened before? No, not since it was fucked. Not that loud. Check engine light was clicking when that happened. What do you think it could be right now, buddy? The starter? How's your battery? How's the battery? Uh, pretty old. It has some fucking corrosion on it. Women. That's <laughs> the level. How's the battery level on the thing? I don't know. Hey. Very good. <laughs> I'll take care of it. Let me see that. You got it? All right, come on. <laughs> Let's go to the Save my truck. and a half bolt. Yeah? That's enough. Okay. So what are you going to do? You have to use a brake with this? No, huh? No. And... Oh, you do have battery level. Yeah, I knew it was working. Why is your battery at that? Is it cause your battery some of the is dials are dead. fucked. No, some of the dials are fucked. Then well, why would the check engine light be on, though? Why does your battery light up when it says message center? Because it's fucking dead. Mm -hmm. The gas gauge doesn't work either. We're gonna go with some cables. You got cables at your house, Flame? I do. I have a set right in the van, probably right over here, buddy. I bet you I might have a set in the van. I might not, though. But I might. I don't think I do, buddy. I think they're at my place. No, they're not here. They're at I, the house. I hate it. Oh. Do you want me to get the cables? Yeah. There you go, buddy. What the fuck is this, man? Jumper cables, right? No, they're not. <laughs> what? <laughs> Brand uh, new, just for you. Yeah, they're... My dad gave them to me. They're eight gauge, man. You want fucking four gauge. Oh, fuck's sakes, eh? Well, maybe it's better than nothing. Yeah, I Don't put it on there yet. Put it on your car. <sighs> put the negative on the black one. This yeah. is going to be that yes. Because that's, that's the red one. Yes. Okay, ready? Yes. No, I don't think we have enough room. Pull up a little bit more now. Uh, put yours to the ground then, to the ground of your vehicle. Um, yeah, put yours to the ground of the vehicle. Right there. Yeah, I'll put mine up here. Can I reach here? No. Here, oh, a little bit closer. Sorry. No, it's not your fault. The plate is gone. It's my fault. Why? Because the cables are short? Yes. <laughs> oh, shit. My cables are pretty blue. Yeah. Let me see that. Let me see that. Yeah. <laughs> I 
I don't think I've ever seen them not like that. I know. <laughs> They're always like that. I, I, I try to do them often, but you, now you got power. Now you have power. Starter issue? Well, you got power on it. They ground to the engine, so it's not like it's a ground wire. Yeah, it's a starter. Give me something heavy that I can hit it. Something heavy, huh? How about my deck? And when you make the click noise, you know that it, the starter is ready to go. So, or ready to start. So what you, what I can do is check the, uh, the signal wire with the voltmeter. Mm. And I mean, you're getting a signal because yeah. it wants it to go. So you just need a new starter. Case okay. closed, done. Right. I just changed it in my car freaking two weeks ago. But because there's no hammer, we're not going to bang it today? What, to get it started? To get stalled somewhere that isn't your property? I guess you make a good point. Right. It was stalled at Blake's house. We pushed it over here. Are you fucking... You pushed it here? Yeah, we fucking pushed it here. Holy not, shit. Not by myself. Sounds, uh... Painful. Yeah, it was pretty fucking heavy. <laughs> uh, okay, I finally made it on the ground, boy. Okay. What were you saying? Okay, the starter is disconnected from the engine. I will be pulling it out now. There are a few wires that look like they are in the way. So we will maneuver around them. We will pull off. You're going to have to do a retake on this. You're going to have to do a retake on this, boy. A retake, boy. I wonder if you can hit that. Oh, there, that's the issue. Okay. It is really fucking tight. Really tight. Holy cow. Really tight. Wow. And it's because of the fucking dipstick tube. Because of the dipstick tube? The dip. So, what we gotta do is just turn it out of that. Holy cow, that's that's crazy. Who the hell would do that? Apparently Chevy. Wow. It's like just impossible. I gotta go like this just old. Did you feel that, Did you feel that little breeze, eh? Oh, that was cold. Ugh. So what's it's the dipstick that's holding it in right now? No, it's not. What's what's the problem right now? The problem is it's so damn tight around here I can barely move it. It's very, very, very tight, man. I'm trying to think if it's just because of that. Some wires are like, holy fuck, they're tight. I just have to maneuver them. It's like, I'm like... Pulling it out this much, and it's like just can't do this little tiny gap, just a little bit out of the way, because that thing, just a little tiny bit of restriction causing it not to come out at all, not to come out at all, just a little tiny restriction there. Wow. What is it? I see this. Put it in my head. Okay, go ahead. Turn it around. Look at what I am dealing with. It's so close to coming out. It's so close. But the dipstick, you can see it. And it's just preventing me. I can move it everywhere. And that's the way the cookie crumbles. You popping it out, bud? Yeah. You got her, eh? It's, uh, a horrible, horrible. What's all that stuff? Extra parts? That's the, uh, which ended up popping off as I took it off. What did you call it? The heat guard. Yeah, it popped off as I pulled it out. Awesome. So we removed the heat guard. Now here we're dropping a little bolt, nut, we're going to take that off, take our gauntlet off, 
Oh no, Rourke, he's going, we're going down the gauntlet. I don't think I can make it. Do you remember that one? No. The River Wild. The River Wild? With Kevin Bacon and Helen Hunt. <laughs> yeah, I don't think I've ever seen it. It's a great What's movie. the line? We're going down the gauntlet. No one ever goes down the gauntlet. Rourke, I don't know. <laughs> I want you to take us down the gauntlet because we stole the money from when we robbed the bank. I know, but nobody survives the gauntlet. No. <laughs> they did, though. Or no, they didn't. You have to watch the sea. You have to watch the sea. You know? <laughs> they made it. They made it. No, they didn't. No, nope, they didn't. Oh, my didn't. God. <coughs> That's so funny. <laughs> no spoilers here, eh? Come on, eradicated Jake. Eradicated Jake. Eradicated Jake. I don't have any safety glasses. Oh. <laughs> here you go, boy. Bring this to the pet shop, boy. Oh, ah! that's it! Ah! Ah! Oh, there's a hand on the stove. Ah! Ah! <laughs> let's see, let's see. This is my phone. Oh. They're not the same, though. I don't think they're the same, but that's okay. We can go deal with it. Eradicated Jake. Not quite, eh? Eradicated Jake. Eradicated Jake. Eradicated Jake. They're not quite the same, boys. No, they're not the same. All right. Ew, what is that? That's blood from your snot. Ah! What is that? Ah! What does my face look like? I can't see my face. Am I bleeding? No, you just look like a D. So okay. instead of your bolt being here, it's it's there. So this one here is in the right orientation with the engine. And you actually have a new bolt in there for some reason. Why is there a new bolt in this? I don't want to use this. It's not... We'll be using the grade 8 bolt that comes with it. <clears throat> Thank you, sir. You can put this in. We'll be taking this today. Randy, can you come here? And now he's back under for more thunder. Jake Jekyll and the never-ending story. All right, boy. So what we're doing is a little couple things here, and I'm not going to tell you anything. No, I'm kidding. I'm putting a nut on a bolt. <laughs> it's the uh, signal switch, so it'll be from your ignition. And here's the other one. This is the actual power. This will go right here. <laughs> Just messing with you, you know. What about the heat shield? What about it, boy? You gotta put it on, boy? Fuck your mother. <laughs> yeah, oh god. <laughs> Just making sure it's all right, boy. Oh, you forgot to take that off? Or did you? No, I don't think you forgot. <laughs> I think it, it does go just like that, yeah, right there. And you just tighten it up with the jake brake. And now you always want to make sure that your power's off. So you have your battery disconnected right now, or else you would be killed. Stubby. Yeah, you, you just you don't know until you do the job once. Then. And if you ever have to do it again, then you know, you know. So yeah, let's. What you do, you way back. It's fucking cold, buddy. Oh. How's your hands freezing? Not at all, actually. I feel decent. I don't know what you're worried about. It's decent. 
I don't use those shields, but I guess we will today. Why, because the camera's on? <laughs> no, because hey. it's a Chevy. <laughs> and I don't deal with Chevys. I'm a Ford guy. <laughs> Whatever. Oh, for fuck's sakes, man. <laughs> a Ford guy? Uh, yeah. Yep! <sighs> My name, don't wear it out, boy. And there you go. Bob's your uncle. So hopefully we can get her back in there and uh, at ease without breaking too much. Up, up, and away. That's it? Not, not quite. Very, very, oh yeah, okay, so very, 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 very close this time. Yeah, I think we'll get it in there pretty good. We'll take $3.09 worth of footage. And what we have here is <laughs> the new starter put in place by me, made by me. And that is Katie's feet. All right. There you go, jack me off, boy. Okay, and now we exit the vehicle and we bring two tools with us this one and the other. <laughs> Holy fuck. You put on your batteries? No, you're gonna need to wipe this trucker down. Hold uh, down. That's alright, you ain't got the electric grease, so we're just gonna put it on without it. Now I should be putting that I don't have it, it's at the house. Dialect. Don't film me putting on a battery post with an adjustable wrench. Get out of town. <laughs> Get out of town. Hang on. Uh, it's probably dead, dude. The battery's probably fucking dead. You hear that? Bears. What's that, buddy? Yeah, the grass is pretty soft, eh? Success! Success! I'm taking for a ride. You love it? You love that kind? Awesome, right? Okay, Blake, she's gonna back out and then I'm gonna jump in. <laughs> it's a good thing she didn't run over your phone, eh, buddy? Look at that. You did a great job. Great job. Anything here, just let me know. A couple days later, since I did the fucking uh, video about the starter with Bank, and I got him here over here, and he's like dying to tell you his opinion about it. So that's what's up. I came outside to get some light. Okay, tell me what you think about the battery. Oh, we didn't put it on a load tester. Um... You checked it in the video. I didn't watch all the footage yet, but you checked it in the video and it said that it was 12 volts the battery. 12 four, yeah. And then when you went under it, the starter clicked. Still said it, yeah. So we had power at 12 four, but uh, the amperage, the battery must have been on a 12 three, 12 four, 12 six. They each give you different um, percentages of battery life. And I think we were on the lower end of the battery. Therefore, we didn't have enough juice to start. So it might not have been the starter. However, we changed that too. That's not bad. I mean, at least it's uh, replaced, right? 
<clears throat> Better to have a newer part than an older part, right, buddy? Done.